Back now, new at 5.30, canine distemper continues to ravage our community, and the warm winter we are having, today notwithstanding, could make things worse. More than 160 shelter and rescue dogs have died of the disease in the last two months alone. But you can take steps to protect your pet. 17's Marco Torres joins us now with this update. The deadly canine disease known as distemper is extremely contagious. It can't be passed on to humans, but it can and will be passed on to unvaccinated dogs who come into contact with other dogs who are infected. This is a puppy with distemper. Listen to the sounds it makes as it tries to breathe. These squeaks are strained breaths. You can see the puppy is exhausted and lying on its side. Distemper is an immune suppressive disease. So this is something that is an incurable disease. It's extremely um, contagious, it's viral, and it can spread rapidly. The puppy and its five siblings all died from distemper not too long after this video was taken. But this family of puppies is just a small drop in the bucket of more than 160 shelter and rescue dog lives that have been lost to the disease in just the last couple of months. Unvaccinated community, coupled with the fact that the seasons are warm for longer, animals roam for longer, it's a very agricultural area, it's a perfect storm um, for distemper to spread quickly. Your own yard could be unsafe if an infected dog leaves traces of distemper on your fence. The best way to protect your dogs is to get them vaccinated. Distemper normally affects um, very young puppies or uh, unvaccinated dogs, but we're also seeing dogs as old as eight years old that are testing positive for distemper. Older dogs and puppies can be infected and killed by distemper. It's extremely important to get them vaccinated as soon as they become of age. The next free vaccination clinic hosted by Unity Canine will be available on February 12th in Bakersfield. In Bakersfield, Marco Torres, 17 News. And there's also